working as a care aide, you know, you, you do look after seniors and uh, you're the first contact for them. And, and also some seniors uh, don't have any family, so you advocate for them. Uh, I work at Peace Portal Seniors Village. I've worked there for 31 years. I work as a mobile harm reduction outreach worker. Um, we work as a team of two and uh, we drive around giving out harm reduction, um, working with people that are dealing with substance use issues, trauma, mental health, addictions. It's humbling. It's humbling to look after seniors. Learn a lot from them. They, uh, you ask their life experiences. Because I was raised by my grandma and most of them I treat like they're my own. Rewards of the job are when we see people wanting to make a change in their life and they're coming out actually asking for our support. And we come from a non-judgmental place of helping and supporting them and meeting them wherever their needs are. If I look at um, what our needs are in our community these days and how we are supporting individuals, um, us as workers, we're not, we're not being supported enough. Um, it's not a... It's not a light job that we do. We see a lot of trauma, we see death, we see people, we deal with overdoses on a regular basis and we are bringing people back to life, but the impact that it takes on my fellow colleagues, it's a lot and we don't have enough wraparound services just for our workers. Like in my floor there's 40 residents and there's three of you or two of you because you know someone calling sick and you keep going because you, you, you don't want uh, you need to give them care. Like, you cannot leave them in bed or have no breakfast. I have been a BCG member for over 20 years. Well, being a union member is like, we're family. I have people behind me backing me up. Our, our voices are needed, and if I could be part of that, so I try to do more and more as I can. When I came to Canada when I was 24, and we never thought of having a rights as employee, you, you have value. <laughs>